Derby is steeped in women's history and it feels so special to be carrying on that legacy of the, the activism of women in this city, whether it, it's, you know, some might see as something small as just standing up and having your voice, but women were doing that 100 years ago in Derby. So for us to be walking in their footsteps, and it, it's a shame we're still having to do it 100 years later, but we are carrying on the legacy that they started. We care about the women in our city and we are change makers. The global story of International Women's Day celebrations around the world date back to 1911. But in the heart of the UK, a group of women in Derby gathered together in 2016 and wondered what the local history of their city and their local county of Derbyshire had been. They went to their local studies library in the city of Derby and found only two index references to International Women's Day activities in their area. But they knew they'd heard clues and talk and memories of it going back a bit further, but they didn't know how far. So in 2016, they joined together with Heritage Partners Culture Train and secured Heritage Lottery funding to train up 20 women and children in local study research skills. They dove into the archives, looked back over every March for over 100 years to see what was in the newspapers and the archives on record. They were surprised to discover suffragette routes going back to the early 1900s and decades of incredible records, photographs and stories which are captured in this film to tell Derby's history. Uh, 1975 was the year of UN uh, acknowledged and recognized and made it uh, as an international uh, women's day before that it it was more of the left movement that was um, that was celebrating commemorating it as an international women's day but UN had never I recognized it or acknowledged it and put it on their sketches book. Um, and they did uh, in 70, 75. And after 75, um, Indian Work Association made sure that they, they celebrate and they commemorate the day. <laughs> 